I just a few days ago had one of my like apocalypse dreams, but it was yes. like yes. Oh my god! Get I'll out try there. to tell this very quickly because I know telling dream stories can be really boring sometimes to other people. But basically, uh, nighttime, uh, go outside. Everyone's outside looking up at the sky, going like, "What the fuck is that?" And there's like, um, all over the planet from the night sky, uh, descending from space is um, patterns of giant stained glass windows that are hexagons. But when they finally landed, it was like a weird Swedish Ikea style gift shop and like museum um, that just had normal employees. And it was like some weird thing where like the, the president, some made up president of the United States got on TV and said, uh, oh, sorry, this was like a cultural exchange program and we forgot <laughs> to tell everyone this was happening. Mm -hmm. um, and there was a point where I got in to like the cafeteria and they were advertising uh, like, hey, the place you're in right now, out of all the different places that just dropped from space, this is the only one that's got the world's only quiet Vinnies. It's like, what the fuck is the world's only quiet Vinnies? And I went downstairs and it's this really narrow corridor where you walk forward and then there's a bed and instead of a headboard for the bed, there's a wall with a glass window. And on the other side is a guy who's operating a very tiny pizzeria called Vinny's. And it's not called Quiet Vinny's. This is the only Vinny's that That's is quiet. quiet. And this is a place where you can only get one slice of pizza. Granted, it's big. It's like this. It's like a nine, it's like a quarter of a pizza. I'll continue this after the cutscene. Quiet face. <laughs> uh. <gasps> yeah, man. Okay, gotta fight some three panic attacks now. Oh my god, three! I, or maybe it's not three. Um, but so the way quiet this quiet Vinny's works is the re all the other Vinny's are really loud because the the machine that makes the pizza is super loud. Like you don't see the guy tossing the dough. Like I said, there's the headboard with the glass, and the other side is the single guy working at the pizzeria. Yeah. All the other Vinnies, they push a button, and the pizza machine that makes the pizza is super fucking loud, and it's rattling. This place, the machine is really nice and greased up. It's super quiet. Ooh. Ooh. What's going on here? All right. Wow, I did it so quick! How did I do that? I thought there was a second nice. guy there. Huh? Hey, where'd he go? Quiet Vinnies. <laughs> he went to Quiet Vinnies. And the guy, while well, the guy pushes the button to make the pizza machine start making the pizza, you only get one slice, again, it's big, and it can only be cheese or pepperoni, that's it. That's it. The guy- I'm like, surprised you, they even give you a choice. So what happens while you're waiting for the pizza to be made is you lay down in the bed that's right up against the glass window, and the guy is like talking like ASMR voice, and he just can, asks can you- Can you imitate it for the mic? So he asks you really simple questions like, what's a place you would really like to go take a vacation to that you haven't been to yet? And, <laughs> you know, what's what's a really nice movie that you watched recently? And, and shit like that. <laughs> <laughs> and... And then there's a certain point where it's like he asks you all those questions and you're getting sleepy on the bed as you're waiting for the pizza to be made because again, this is the only quiet Vinny, so you can get sleepy there. Quiet and the Vinny's. guy asks you, okay, you don't have to do this, but this is a service we offer to all of our customers. Do you want me to cuddle you? <laughs> and I was like, yeah. And so this dude was like the big spoon or whatever. I was waiting for the pizza to be made and I fell the fuck asleep. And In then your he dream, woke, you fell asleep because you're being And then he, 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 you know, grabbed my shoulder and then fuck. And this guy was like, wear like normal, like an apron. And he was like, he had pizza dough over, he had pizza dough all over his face and shit. You know, he was making his pizza. Face. You need flour? Or flour, sorry, flour, not pizza dough. He had dough like lumps all no, over his had, face. No, he had flour and stuff. Like, it's just what a guy would look like if you were working in a little Caesar or something. But he got in bed and big spoon me and then he woke me up is like hey dude your pizza's done and it was really good and then I left and that was how my apocalypse dream ended 